don't have to fight with this child, like we just get along, you know? Like it's just like sis. It's not even names for the different types of issues that she do. I'm a name my own today. The beautiful life gets red oily, it gets red. It gets red. Oh! It gets Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. If it's your first time being here, sister, brother, mama, aunt, you're so welcome. It's been a minute, it's been hours, it's been months. I know, I know, I've ghosted, but you know, I'm back, I'm better. You know, I'm in such a good place in my life right now. I've been going through some things, but you know what? I'm good now, I'm all good. Please subscribe to my channel, like subscribe click the notification bell if you haven't already so you know when i do post it just goes like ding ding on your phone you know Please comment down below i'd love to talk to you guys i want to know if this video was helpful if you enjoyed it what you want me to do what you want me to change i want to talk to you guys you know i want to talk to you guys i want to you know you know guys please check out my page that i do um that i post my work from braids weave treatment you guys check it out if you're in and around durban um you can check that out i can revive your weave Ooh, trust me i can do that so the link is down below my instagram page please also follow me on instagram um my my name on instagram is nobushabendalo underscore but the link is also down below like so actually go and follow me today is ages one on one it is one on one. We're gonna. I'm gonna show you guys how I do my baby hairs, whatever you wanna call it, baby hairs, edges, but ah. So it's not necessarily like a tutorial. It's just me showing you how I do my edges. And um, yeah, this has been a highly requested video. So uh, <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to do the wavy tangs, you know. And um, yeah. So today's all about you know we're sculpting them edges, we're you know, making them right. You know. Yeah, thank you so much for everyone who's still supporting me. Oh my gosh, I appreciate it because I'm not ghosted. If you want to see how I do this and how I achieve these edges, keep watching so it's First things first, I'm just gonna like brush away, like brush the baby hairs or the hair that she left out away from the actual hairstyle. If you have a hairstyle, I like brushing out my front parts of my edges because it makes my hair less thick, you know, which will allow uh, the gel to just like smoothly um thing so i mean to like to it allows the gel to lay down my edges smoothly like when my hair is like nice and combed and you know it doesn't have any knots and so then once that is done i'm going to take this amazing amazing gel if you have natural hair this gel honestly is for you i have yeah well, you don't understand like before i used to perm or relax the very 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 front of my edges um because i had tried so many gels and they wouldn't lay down my hair you know and stuff and i just thought hmm okay i might as well just like you know just relax the front part of my hair so that my edges lay down so um the lady that was doing my hair actually felt like a lot a lot a lot of my hair out but yeah i relaxed like a small portion so um since the hair does grow out and become natural again uh, i was like can you get a relaxer relax my hair and do it and do you know so i'm able to do my edges when i actually have this hairstyle so when i got them this one lady introduced me to this gel this gel right here i don't know it doesn't really want to show vida for life molding gel oh yo y'all don't understand like this gel is so amazing it is amazing like every natural girl out there needs to get beautiful life because girl this thing does the thing that made the parts need to be done Sis. and i'll demonstrate i'll demonstrate because i'll be using this obviously there's pros and cons but i'll mention that later so anyway i will take a bit of this actually no this is a lot y'all y'all just look at this look at this this is look 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 this is all natural all natural not permed sis hell oh, sis this is natural i don't know if you're ready but just watch watch okay okay look look at that 
Like, we don't, we don't fight. We don't have to fight with this child. Like, we just get along, you know? Like, it's just like, sis. Like this gel, it's it's the one, you know. Like I don't have to fight with this gel, you know. Like I'm gonna show y'all again. <laughs> look, look, look. It just lays down. Like I don't have to discipline it. I don't have to fight with it. Like it listens to me. It listens to me. And the gel is absolutely amazing. And it's not expensive at all because I paid twenty eight rand for this one. This one here, it is the smallest one. But the next time I go there, I'm definitely buying a big, a bigger one because I also use it to braid like my clients and stuff. So and every single natural girl needs this. Also, if you have relaxed hair, this is also another option for you. This is literally for all types of hair, but I'm mentioning mostly the natural girls because I know how hard it is to lay down your edges. You know, I know it's difficult. Yeah, let's move on. So anyway, um, literally like edges with edges it's what you make of it there's no right or wrong way to actually do edges like, so like it's just about if you have seen all different types of edges and you've tried them out and there's a specific one that works for you you continue doing that you know don't let anyone else make you feel less of a person i guess just because the edges aren't the way they want them to look your edges is what you make of it you know there's no right or wrong there's not even names for the different types of edges that you do i'm gonna name my own today you can either use a toothbrush right or you can use a comb an actual rack i think it's called a rat tail comb i'm not really sure but dika mika i guess what i prefer to use i like to use them both because with the toothbrush it smoothens out the edges and then with with um with the comb it it you know it makes them maneuver i don't know so anyway you will start off with like pulling down the edges as okay you do start off with actually putting on the the gel then you pull down the edges i have a lot so you guys will probably have less of less than me and stuff guys the more hair you have the hard it is to actually do your edges. It is so annoying. Um. So yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna pull the hair down, and then you're just gonna swirl the toothbrush. I'm gonna bring back the hair and stuff because it's like so much hair. So I'm gonna bring it back, and I'll like just make a thing out of it. I'll make something curly out of it. Guys, like I said, there's no name specifically given for edges. So today I'm going to give these edges my own name. I want to call this one the Gong Gong. I want to call it the Gong Gong because it reminds me of um, the Mapiano song, the Gong Gong Mapiano song. Because it's like, it's like a knock. It's like, it's like this. It's like a knock. It's like, ding, 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 ding. This is called the Gong Gong Baby Hit because it knocks. I'm going to actually just do the exact same thing, but I'm going to change the direction. So, okay, I'm going to restart that. Trial and error, guys. Trial and error. of the baby hair and I don't really know what I'm gonna do so I'm just I'm just gonna oh and this one I'm gonna call it the way yeah so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do here but yeah I'll just Yeah. 
So I'm going to just give this side a try. The only reason why I'm going to do two of these is because I have the, um, the, the dun dun thing. I have the, the chain things, whatever they call it, the rings. Okay, so you're going to take your toothbrush. Okay, this side I'm actually, let me do the side of the toothbrush actually. So this gel is hard, so it's easy to use a right tail comb, but I'm going to do the side of the toothbrush. With this gel, obviously it's good for molding down, but another thing is it makes you sweat a lot, like it's very oily, which is like a huge disadvantage. And another thing, after some time, after a few hours, your hair does fly up, but it all works with like, the more hair you have out, the higher the chances your hair will actually start um, flying up and stuff like that. So obviously with me, that's going to happen a lot. So that's why I advise you guys to actually have less hair that you do, you know, um, put out for baby hairs. So what I do, the trick that I've been using to actually make my hair stay down for like an entire day, I use the Revlon Flex Gel with the extreme hold of four. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm trying quite hard. But um yeah, I, just, I've, I've, I use this gel a lot because it's amazing. It's got like really good hold. So I just like put it down on my edges like this. It will look weird for some for now. Take like a head wrap, like a double, and you're going to fold it up into four. Okay, I'm sure you guys know how to fold up into four, make it like a bit smaller. And then you're gonna take it and then you literally like lay it on your edges. And you're gonna tie it back. Your head's gonna look weird and squashed. But yeah, this is to flatten out the edges and this really helps, especially with the Vita for Life, it gets really oily, it gets red. It gets red. Oh! It get it get gets red like it layers down the hair and also like it removes the oiliness of the actual gel. So you, you're gonna actually have this on for about ten minutes. So So this is how the final thing looks like um yeah I, I i like it um it's pretty cool but i won't i won't tell you guys that this is like simple stuff obviously i am much ooh, geez, i am much more faster at doing it because you know practice the practice is like gets better so i don't know every single day dedicate yourself to doing um edges in order to actually know different techniques and what works for you and also the video was enjoyable because i wouldn't really say helpful because it wasn't necessarily like a tutorial it was just kind of me showing you guys how i do my own edges and stuff so um yeah thank you so much for everyone who's supporting me and i'll see you guys in my next video so peace peace